My name is Mary Dunleavy and I'm singing Constanza. My name is Anna Christie and I'm singing Bologna in San Francisco Opera's production of The Abduction from the Seraglio by Mozart. These female characters are very strong for 18th century characters and uh, I think Constanza fem is a feminist and um, I identify with that because she's just, go girls. and. Uh, Anna Christie plays uh, Blonda and she is very spunky as well and um, doesn't like to get pushed around and talks back. And Constanza does the same thing but in a different way because she's a noble woman and um, she carries herself with a little more uh, nobility and grace. But she's also very strong and has very particular ideas about a woman's place in society and how she should be treated with respect. And, um, and her ideas of love, of course, are very much one one man and one woman and if you make a vow to somebody that you hold on to that vow you know no matter what happens come hell or high water I find that the strength of Blonda her refusal to be or to be um, controlled by anyone. That part of Blonda is a joy to play, of course, because uh, who doesn't want to pay, play a, a strong woman? If you so much as lay a finger on me, I'll scratch out your eyes! By the beard of the prophet, she's a wild cat! I think having dialogue as opposed to recits in, a, in an opera is challenging because a, as a singer you're not trained to speak 
as, a, as an actor is. But to be sure, the way you love, everything comes down to command. I pity thee. You if you don't do it correctly, you can actually tire your voice out, and then when it's time to sing, your voice is not in the place that you were when you warmed up and left your dressing room. <laughs> When the audience, you know, hears the English, they laugh when it's supposed to, when they're supposed to laugh instead of they laugh when they read. That it's funny. <laughs> when, which is like, I don't know, ten seconds after you said the funny part in German. I am your slave. Yeah. <laughs> I dare you to say that again. You are my slave, and I command you this very instant to love me. It can be like a ride when it's all when it's all going and you're feeling great and he takes you on this journey of it is like a roller coaster almost. Mozart was so clever in his writing of comedic characters musically. Because I think with Mozart and singing Mozart, it's very challenging. But you also he gives you everything you need to make the character and the music line up. It's all right there in the score, um, and that makes my job very simple. He, he's, He's obviously a genius, he's quite clearly a genius.